Good for you for knowing already that you're gay. That's great. Pillow Talk! Well, everyone, um, welcome back to Pillow Talk Monday. What did you just throw off of yourself? I had a hair. Oh. It's a hair. Disgusting. For those of you that are back at school, congratulations, or if you're in high school, I'm sorry. I wish I was still in college. I mean, you could always go back to college. Yeah, but when you're 55 like I am, it's kind of frowned upon a little bit, you know? You're, if you're like going... The, the dusty dyke at all the baby dykes parties. Yeah, I'm like yeah. going, hitting up the college parties with my walker, and they're just like, why is this professor here? And I'm like, no, I'm a freshman, bitches! Woo! This week, um, what we're talking about is being a lesbian in high school versus being a lesbian in college. If you're in high school, high school just sucks, okay? It's not gonna get better in high school. I'm sorry, you need to deal with it. It's awful, but literally deal with it because then when you, once you get to college- It's worth it. It's so worth it's it. It's like you're getting a promotion. To being a great lesbian. No matter what degree you get, you're not going to use it anyways. So it's really fantastic. You might as well just enjoy the time you have being young, having fun. That's what it's for. I was an art history major. Now look at me. I'm the star of a semi-successful lesbian channel on the YouTube. <laughs> so I will be high school because I'm the loser. Okay. I'll be college because I'm fun. In high school, it's mandatory, you're gonna fall in love with your best friend. It happens. And in college, you're gonna sleep with your straight best friend. Clothing. In high school, I mean, you try and sort of dress like you, but basically you're just kind of dressing like everyone else. Because you just want to fit in. I used to wear things with flowers on them. And in college, you're wearing double flannel. Double flannel shirts flannel pants. In high school, when you used to watch like a gay TV show, you're like in your room in like the pitch black underneath your covers on your computer. It's like muted down to barely audible so no one else can hear. Because you can't have your parents come in and be like, what are you watching? And in college, you're like, everybody come to my dorm for a lesbian porn party. In high school, if you happen to find the only other out lesbian at your school, and you had a girlfriend, if you wanted to make out with that girlfriend, you were doing it the 15 minutes that your parents weren't home, in some deserted parking lot after dark, lying to your parents, telling them we're going to the movies. You never went to the movies. We like to call it the 15 mile makeout because you had to travel at least 15 miles to make out with your girlfriend. And in college, you're just making out in front of everyone. On campus, in your dorm, in the cafeteria, in class, in front of your mom. Coming out in college or as high school is also very different because when you're in high school, you kind of sort of not really come out. You kind of pull a little bit of a Kristen Stewart where you like, you dip your little toe out of the closet. And then in college, you just cannonball out. You don't care what's out there. You didn't like test the water. You're just all in. Friends in high school. But most of your friends are straight or they're in the closet and they're a little bit boring. And then in college, you're getting your lesbian bike gang together. You guys are going to all the sports events together. You're having Fagin' and Friday parties. If they're not a lesbian, you can't sit with us. You're gonna have a crush on your teacher. High school, college, you're always gonna have a crush on your teacher. But in high school, I mean, it's never gonna happen. But in college, you can bang your teacher. You could go on a date with your teacher. You could be in like a relationship with your teacher and like people ain't gonna get fired. What? It's frowned upon, but it's still a possibility. You have a better chance of winning the lottery, but it still could happen. All right, so Faking It is back this week, which means Faking It Fridays are also gonna be back. What? This Friday, every Friday, every we are going Friday. to be faking it. We're gonna fake it every Friday. Every Friday. 
leave a comment with are you in high school are you in grade school are you in college or are you uh are you a are you dusty dead? dyke are you, are you dusty dyke like us, like us. Mm -hmm. thumbs up for college and we'll see you guys next monday on friday well yeah monday for so this yeah, and then friday for the you know <laughs> you know okay goodbye and i'm gonna enjoy myself I'm gonna have the greatest time ever. It's gonna be the best shack party ever. Oh, does he have a DJ? It just has a gay guy that's just singing Mariah Carey tunes off the top of his We're head. We're there. Yeah, I'm gonna go to it. It sounds like a great time.